Nuclear, welcome to the first post. Thank show. you very much. So, how did this name come? The to? Nuclear? Yeah. Very bad with names, man. My song names are also quite ridiculous. Uh, <laughs> nuclear was my email password back in the days. And uh, like, cool, sounds good. Back in the days, or is it still the same? No, no. <laughs> just, just try nuclear once. Yeah. In case you get it. Yeah. After the kind of struggle that you had at one point in time, once you got that break and now you're here, was there like a point when you were like, oh my god, I'm famous? I'm still trying to sort of cope with it. See, the funniest thing that I understood about you, this is when I, you don't give too many interviews. So I watched, so I'd like literally like go through Google and be like, Google, give me one thing. And then I saw one, the one that you did with Anupama. And that's when I realized that this rock star image of you is not true. I mean, you, while you're on stage, that's there. But then off that, you're this family guy who likes spending time with your kid and no after parties. Is that true? Yeah. So you, you don't go for an after party? Extremely rarely, like extremely rarely. I do an after party because like friends wants me to party with them but yeah that's about it so you're telling me that after your gig you would go back home and then sleep and next day you'd wake yeah. up and be like yeah uh, yeah you'd wake your kid up and be like let's i'll drop you to school yeah, so see what happens is that i'll, I'll tell you why i do this um so you finish a gig at two o'clock yeah. yeah yeah and uh it'll take at least an hour to boom out of the place if it's in the same city where my son is my mm. family is then uh, i reach home at around whatever Four o'clock, mm. and uh, I sleep for whatever three hours, and then I have to get up in the morning because I have to get my son ready and uh, give him breakfast, and then get him ready to drop him to the school, and then I come back home is when I get time to work. So if I will after party as well, which means I will not be able to sleep at all, which means when I drop him to the school and come back home is when I will get time to sleep, but that means I will not get time to work. This is the struggles of a rock star we are talking about. <laughs> so that's, that's Who's worried that he won't be able to sleep enough to wake up in the morning to drop his child to school. And then get time to work, yeah. Yeah, so that's the thing. Wow. <laughs> but... <laughs> yeah. Very, very interesting. You're breaking a lot of myths and ideas. Yeah. Nuclear, when you, when you moved to Goa in the beginning, there was this one period, I think almost three years when you didn't have work. Mm. Was there a point when you were like, you know, Probably should I consider something else, or should I should I give up? Was there a point when you felt? Yeah, that? it happens multiple times. No, because uh, I mean it's a it's it's a tough period. My money is not there, and you lose motivation, and then you all negative thoughts seep in. Uh, mm. uh, what will happen? Where is the future going? Should I stop doing this? Should I get a job for myself and then do that? Uh, thankfully, my wife uh, is very supportive. She loves me a lot, and she uh, is always there to like sort things out. Again, going back to this family guy you are, when you drop your kid to school, are there, are there other kids who recognize you and be like, can I have a picture no, with you? The teachers do. The te <laughs> <laughs> yeah, his teacher asked me the other That's day. That's where your connection yeah. is. I, are you a DJ? Like, yeah. Like, how do you know? So are you on Facebook? <laughs> <laughs> now, this is the Red Bull tour bus. We are at Off the Roof, the event that they have. This is your second time performing with them, right? Yeah. What are you the most excited about this time? The lineup is incredible. Yeah, all the people um, have worked with Karsh um, in the past. He, I look up to him as an incredible musician. Yeah. Uh, so is Benny. And uh, this whole setup is so different, man. Like we do so many concerts, we do so many shows, uh, but we don't come across like a setup like this, you know, which is so beautiful. Is there a reason why you don't give interviews? They all what, ask me the same question, man. <laughs> the same question. I get tired of like answering the same questions. You it's want all, huh. it's, when it's interesting, no? Like with you, it's interesting because you're asking me questions. Which, now that's yeah. just just because you have to stare at me. No, I'm now, being honest with you, man. Like even with Anupama, it was it was fun. She was, she was asking like really interesting questions. But if the questions are same all the time, then it's like ah, but you, I mean you can Google it also. It's I mean there now. This is the last part of the show. We always have a game on the show this time. I thought, let's make you read some mean tweets. Tweets? Yeah. Okay. Raman fan, 76. Let's face this, nuclear is ugly as <laughs> Okay, cool. <laughs> and, and the next one is, music reviews, India 212. 
Nuclea is starting to grow on me. Kidding. I hope his DJ machine gets destroyed by an elephant. <laughs> wow, dude. <laughs> wow, what an imagination. I think we, we, this part is going to go viral. Yeah, this is quite major imagination. You should start making movies, dude. Uh, the next one is called Slut Mister. Oh my god, Nuclea makes my ear bleed. What is the STFU? What is the STFU? Shut the fuck up. Shut up. Okay, cool dude. <laughs> Why is he being a cool dude? Why uh, don't you say that back? I, I, I get this like quite a lot. Like, unfortunately or fortunately, either they like my music or they hate my music. Yeah. And the fact of life is that my truest fan, they understand me creatively. Mm. So they know why I'm doing of what course, I'm doing. Of course, of course. Yeah. And uh, people who have either recently discovered what I'm trying to do or like other styles of music and yeah. come on my page to listen to what they want to listen right, to. Right, of course. They sometimes feel annoyed. Okay, next one. There's one more. Yeah, there's one more. BFG Giant. That's his name. If I could choose to punch one giant piece of <laughs> in the face, it would be nuclear. Go on, dude. <laughs> All right. All right. There you go. Yeah. What's the worst piece of criticism that you've ever got? There was a gig uh, in Bombay at a club, and uh, this is about three years back. Mm. And um, so I wasn't uh, as famous as I am now. So mm. I went on stage and I did my sound check. And the person who was taking care of that club came up to me and he told me, like, what are you playing? What? So I said, I'm playing my own music. Like, but we don't play this sort of stuff in the club. So I said, but I don't have anything else. I'm going to play this only, right? Yeah. And uh, he was like so disappointed and grossed out with like, he gave me like looks and all. But anyways, I ended up playing my own music. And uh, two years later, three years later, the same guy booked me for that same place. And <laughs> how many people were there? It's 900 odd people in that place. Wow. Club, so, yeah. yeah. Well, that's like revenge taken. <laughs> Cool man, I don't really bother so much, it's alright. So sweetly yeah. you say, huh? cool. everything is cool, cool. Yeah, Keep right, going. Man. <laughs> Thank you so much, Nuke. It was Pleasure great fun talking to you. you. We had a good conversation, I liked it. I loved it as Put well. Red Bull. Yeah. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> Pleasure, Zalman. Thank you so much. Vinidal, welcome to the first four show. Thank you. We are at the Red Bull tour bus off the roof 2016. Yes. Yes. You and you're performing here for the first time yeah. for these guys. Yes. How excited are you? I'm extremely excited because uh, this show is all my content. All the songs yeah. I've been writing for, the, writing for the last five years with my band, Functuation. And uh, um, it's uh, been arranged pretty well. We've worked really hard and we've uh, we have written some songs. We've rearranged those songs, you know, because like uh, we, we, we haven't played our content in so many years because of, you know, my busyness with uh, the Bollywood music uh, uh, concerts that I do mostly. Yeah. And uh, now it's time to uh, drop something sick. See, I thought we'll talk about your life, but then through some of your best songs in different years. You really like the song called Nila. Nila ka girad. Yeah, it's one of my favorite songs too. Nila ka girad, neelam te girad, yarum rasika villai, chinna kai gal matum ne kaanum. Kaatru visum, vayil kaayum kaayum, adil maatra medu millai. Now, 2005 is what I want to talk about, this movie called By the People. Oh my god. <laughs> Listen, just by the way, if you've not watched By the People, go watch it. That's shouldn't. an acting debut please, as well. Please, please, shouldn't. In Malayalam. Please. I just acted because I was, I was casted into it. They thought I would like do the role well, but... It, it's not my cup of tea, to be very honest. Like, it's if I act, it'll be like disrespect. This to is actors. like a series to a movie. <laughs> yeah, series to a movie called For the People. For the People. Yeah. Which was a rage back then. Yeah, that was Where? that was a very uh, big movie, and the expectations on the movie was like pretty huge. After that, the song that I really loved, which came from you, is Adiye Kollathe. Oh my God! One of my favorite movies till now. The kind of Varnam Airam, Surya. Do you remember the lyrics? Yeah, yeah. For a couple of lines. Adiye kulle de, arago alle de, ulagam surang de, iruvar ladang de, unnod naadakum, ovvor naadikum, arthangal sendir de. 
and after this in 2009 was when something major happened to you when you won the rd burman mm. award at film fair this was um, kaise mujhe yeah. mil gaye this is gajni yeah listen when i say when i take a song no just like that's the cutest thing oh seriously kaise mujhe tum mil gayi kismat pe aaye na yaqeen utar aayi jheel mein jaise chand utarta hai kabhi hale hale dheere se 2015 So again, one of my interesting songs called Bang Bang. Oh my God, this is fun, na? Huh? Yeah, yeah. And Bang Bang sounds like this. Teri meri, raat ne kiye kuch idade, mili hai jo abhi mulaqate, to koi jadoo ne ko hai. Thank you so much, Thank Bani. you, Rani.